Hi everybody, it's Chris from PipesTraveler.com. We're coming to you with a new episode of Stupid Stuff. All kinds of interesting things that you might enjoy. If you're a hunter, if you're a fisherman, if you love to travel, if you're an RVer, it doesn't matter. If you spend a lot of vehicle, a lot of time in your vehicles doing outdoor activities, you're gonna love a lot of our videos. So anyway, this is Stupid Stuff, and we're, today we're gonna to talk about storage. There's never enough storage in our vehicle, in our RV, and we just thought I'd show you some, a new idea that we came up with to create more storage space in your vehicle, assuming you have a truck or some kind of a vehicle like we do. So let's take a look. Right here in the back of my Ford F-150, and if you look down underneath the seat, you'll see the profile of the storage box underneath there. It matches the profile of the seat just about perfect. It could actually be designed and built a little bit wider um, so that's something to keep in mind. Now, if I open up the seat here, you'll see we've got a, a box here that has no bottom to it because you really don't need it. But it's four feet long and about 11 inches wide. It works out perfect for storing all kinds of act, all kinds of stuff. I've got a tool bag right here. I've also got a ultralight fishing box over in the middle here. And over on the far end is a couple of extra jackets and binoculars. Perfect for just extra storage space. I think this will be helpful to you. I'd love to give you some more information about it if you need it. I can give you the dimensions. But we appreciate you taking a look at our episode today of Stupid Stuff here from the Shoshone National Forest. It's about 30 miles outside of Cody, Wyoming. If you like our video, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you would. We appreciate it very much. Chris Pipes, PipesTraveler.com. Thank you.